We're in the quarterfinals. Chris Cote here with Ross Williams. Waves are pumping, and this quarterfinal is absolutely stacked. Carlos Munoz, Griffin Colapinto, Jack Freestone, and the surfer up and riding right now in white, Soli Bailey, the powerhouse from Australia, looking to make a huge push towards qualification. Surfing like that is definitely going to help on a wave like that, one of the bigger, cleaner waves we've seen of the entire morning. Got a lot of time to uh, get a backup score. Let's see exactly how well he surfed on this wave. Nice little fade. Classic sunset wave. Look at that beautiful big wall. That was nice. Swooping carve there from the Aussie. Again, we've talked about how good this kid's technique is. And another little check fade before that wave bottoms out. Actually looking for two more scores. Bura Vida representing Costa Rica is Carlos Munoz. Drops in, quick mistake, but a quick reaction. He's right back out there, so he'll get back in the lineup. The beginning of these heats, no priority. Carlos Munoz, there's that quick reaction. Bam, nice layback snap right in the power zone of that wave. Another beautiful open face car for the Costa Rican. It's getting a good start. I like this these turns right here, a little deeper rail turns. Watch his board tip into the water, gouge it right there. So two solid turns, smaller wave for today's standards from Carlos, but that allowed him to get slightly more radical. And surfing like that, we could see a Costa Rican on the championship tour very soon. Here we go, Jack Freestone, another surfer fighting for qualification. Jack Freestone just celebrated his son Banks' first birthday last week. So definitely riding the high of fatherhood. His son, one year old, born to uh, get a win here at Sunset Beach. Absolutely. Power couple, you mentioned it, is uh, significant other Alana Blanchard had a pretty great awesome result there too at Maui upsetting Lakey Peterson couple of nice snaps here from Freestone six to eight feet 10 12 foot sets it's about 15 to 20 feet on the face it's yeah. still massive out there it really is it's every inch of that what you just said there's there's 20 foot tall waves out there will he go back to back it's a rare feat it has happened in the iron Sonny Garcia Joel Parkinson it's happened, and if you do that, wow, you've done something special. Here he goes, Griffin Colapinto. Deep bottom turn, beautiful carving snap. This wave growing down the line with ferocity. Just cutting out from under the lip there. Had a great view of a solid face of that wave. It was looking to pounce on him, but he escaped unscathed right there. And Sunset Beach is proving to be a pretty pretty great canvas for Wesley Dantas so far today. Yeah, the Dantas brothers, uh, you know, everyone comes here for six weeks and they come for the Triple Crown. Guys are right there. Um, so it's going to be fun to watch that. Really cool to see who gets through because those guys, whoever gets first and second, they'll be in Medina's heat and Julian's. Ooh, super spoilers. Here we go, Carlos Munoz going for a double two, Brad. Can he make it out of the second? Cannot. It's Clam trying to come out. Curtain closes on Carlos Munoz. Carlos just dodged defeat in that last heat and going up and over. Charging into oblivion. Griffin <laughs> Colapinto as Carlos Munoz just feels the weight of the Pacific right between the shoulders. Soli Bailey now. Beautiful round sunset goal. Hits it with authority. He pulls out. Things are getting wild in the lineup, Ross. Yeah, that was showing its teeth right there. Sunset Oof. just owned Griffin. That's what happens under the water when you duck dive out here. You just get spun a million miles an hour uh, upside down. Sometimes you can bear claw. I'm going to take that off of my list of things to do <laughs> on the North Shore. He's getting worked at Sunset. Leave I'd, it to the pros. I'd love to see a replay if we can of that wipeout from Griffin. That was uh, gutsy right there. Absolutely Amazing. charged that late takeoff underneath it. And right there, he did a great job of getting underneath it. Sunset didn't care. It's rather grumpy right now at lunchtime. I think Sunset's hangry is what's going on. It, it needs a good old plate lunch. Welcome back, surf fans. You're watching the Vans World Cup of Surfing. This is quarterfinal heat number one, Carlos Munoz. Upping the ante with this last series of maneuvers. Goes vertical on the inside section. Can he ride out? He cannot, but he did some damage from out the back. Carlos Munoz, the Pura Vida. Through April, you can kind of count on some surf here on the North Shore. 
Captain Bluefoot right here, Chris. Crazy how stuck he is to his board. Watch this. Each turn, really sketchy, and some that board's not even thinking about detaching from him. So really uh, great surfing there, and to be honest, maybe even a little cocky right there. Six minutes to go, Soli Bailey in the lead, Munoz now in second. Jack Freestone has priority, but these last uh, series of waves has just mowed through the competitive area. Watch out, the prone takeoff. Bucking Bronco ride for Griffin Colapinto. He's now back in control on his feet, deep bottom turn, carving a savage cut. Wow. Right through the face of that wave. Surgical, powerful approach from Griffin Colapinto, looking for a 5-9-1. Pretty hard not to give him that number on the strength of that one beautiful, searing, carving maneuver. Like he's on a CT tour, he's that good. Um, who's able to outsurf his competitors. Everyone knows how to compete. Everyone's got the, you know, the logistics down and, you know, how to compete, kind of put a heat together. But that right there was pure talent. That carve was really nice. He kind of separates himself. He tends to do that with that extra firepower, that extra talent. He can, he's able to surf just a little bit better than his competitors at times. And there's a lot at stake. There so is. Maybe it feels a little smaller, but <laughs> right now it's all about good sportsmanship and uh, really just focusing on getting your surfer through this heat. Definitely three stone in third right now means a 617. Sorry, Chris. Yeah, definitely heckling amongst the caddies. And I think Tommy Witz is out there. You know, he's getting really close here. So he's going to want to hold Carlos off. Too late. Here goes Carlos. Carlos Munoz looking for a 591. Deep bottom turn up into the lip. Can he hang on? He cannot. That's the maneuver we wanted to see from Carlos Munoz. He gave it to us. But then Sunset Beach took it right back. I really like that. Freestone, 16th in the ratings. So close. Will he have enough points here with this quarterfinal finish? Here we go. This is Soli Bailey. That was the exact defensive strategy he needed to employ. Throws in a big snapping carve for good measure. Soli Bailey. Well, He's looking for a 6 one, one to potentially flip the heat. I'm not putting it uh, I'm not putting it past him on that turn. That was a pretty incredible snap. May have just solidified his spot uh, on the CT tour right there. Young Aussie, Soli Bailey. And he's getting uh, above 17,000 points with that guaranteed semi finish. And here's Griffin Colapinto, a current championship tour surfer. Last year's Vance Triple Crown of Surfing winner.